Trevor akifanya vitu zake akichukua channel akifanya Trevor watu wanampiga vitu wanasema mbona amechukua mbona ako hivi na ya kuuma na inaumiza sana ni ya kwamba anapigwa paka na wanaume wenzake nilikwambia wanaume siku ni watakaa chini waongee lugha moja wanawake watawaheshimu for those who have posted if congratulation mmefanyia mm. dada yetu haki kwa kumpost mm. lakini pia mjue ya kwamba Trevor pia ni mtu anataka support yenu mbona mzee support boy child na mbona mzee support girl child wote walikuwa kwa uhusiano imeisha lakini why nimeona so many celebrities so many uh, content creators including paka ule mzee mwenye anakunywa maziwa anaitwa nani anaitwa anajitangaje huyu huyu mm. Andrew Kibe mm -hmm. hata amefanya interview na Eve Hello nice people welcome back to my channel of course it's your girl Vicky Vikina and of course tuko hapa na governor 2027 at least leo nimemuita governor <laughs> Mungu anasaidia Mungu ni mwema mm. kila siku mm. na vile umesema yes kwa mapenzi ya Mwenyezi Mungu county government mm. tuna ya Nairobi tunaichukua uh -huh. na tumeanza kupanga mapema kama kawa kama dawa kama chao uh -huh. yes yani unataka kusema 2027 ofisi ni hapa chini panaitwa ngaje hapa za kalawaiti itakuwa hapo <laughs> hapo yeah. kwa kanjo hapo mm -hmm. kwa county government hapo yes. ndo ofisi itakuwa mm -hmm. yeah Anyway, kaspo lacha tuingie to what's trending. Tunajua yeah. tunakutafutanga utupatie mawaidha huko na kule. Yeah. Uh, we had an interview with you after director Trevor went on to fire Eve na maneno mengi ilitokea, right? Yeah. Na tumeona today Eve amemeka bold step. Dada amefungua channel na kweli anapata support. Naweza kuambia kitu moja ambao ujui ni mm. kwamba uh, congratulations to Eve Mungai yes. kwa kufungua channel. Mm inamaanisha kwamba hii tension na pressure na kila kitu imeenda chini mm -hmm. na watu wameanza kuwa watu wazima mm -hmm. kila mtu anafanya shughuli yake mm -hmm. na kwa sababu tuko kwenye safari ya kutafuta yes. na kila mtu lazima atafute mm -hmm. inafika kiwango ambao kila mtu ameruhusiwa mm -hmm. afanye vitu zake yeah. so long as wajapigana mm -hmm. so long as wajaumizana kwa sababu yeah. relationship mingi sana zinaishanga na kukupigana zinaisha na kifo zinaisha na mambo mingi Tabi. lakini bado ninarudia pale kwenye nilikuwa nimesema ni kwamba ni ombi langu Eve mm. Mungai mm. wakiwa pamoja na Trevor warudiane hata kama itachukua mwaka mm. mwaka mbili mm. mwaka tatu mm. ni ombi langu ya kwamba hawa wawili wanajuana mm. warudiane mm -hmm. lakini ya uchungu sana ni ya kwamba uh, na mimi ningependa ni support mm. mama wetu ambao ni Pastor Dorcas Rigadi mm -hmm. kwa kusimama na boy child mm -hmm. Boy child mm. anaonekananga ndo mnyama ndo mtu mbaya kwa kila kitu ambacho inafanyika. Mm. Leo imekuwa ni dirisho wazi ya kwamba unakumbuka siku nye Trevor mm. wamekosana na Eve. Ilikuwa Trevor akifanya vitu zake akichukua channel akifanya Trevor watu wanampiga vitu wanasema mbona amechukua. Mm. Mbona ako hivi? Mm. Na ya kuuma na inaumiza sana ni ya kwamba anapigwa paka na wanaume wenzake. Nilikwambia wanaume siku ni watakaa chini waongee lugha moja wanawake watawaheshimu. Lakini so long as tunakaa tukikuwa na usnitch mm. na tuko na tabia ya kuumana pembeni mm. hatutawahi enda palipopote. Leo hii mimi nasema bila kublink hata macho yangu ni kwamba mbona mzee support boy child na mbona mzee support girl child. Wote walikuwa kwa uhusiano imeisha. Lakini why Nimeona so many celebrities, so many uh, content creators including paka ule mzee mwenye anakunywa maziwa anaitwa nani? Anaitwa anajitangaje huyu? Huyu mm. Andrew Kibe. Mm -hmm. Hata amefanya interview na Eve. Kumbuka bado ule huyo ndio kwa anaongea ujinga. Boy child hajatafuta hata Trevor. Amkalisha chini aseme kuja tufanye interview tuongee. Vijana watajua Vijana watakunywa sumu tutawazika kwa sababu hakuna mtu anataka kuwapea sikio. Kijana anapitia maneno mazito sana. Kijana wa inchi ni maneno mazito anapitia. Ukiamuka so, akiamuka asubuhi kila mtu kuanzia kwa mama yake mzazi, mke wake, madada zake, kila kitu including paka umbwa inategemea mtoto kijana. Mtoto kijana hayuko safe kwa mkono hata polisi. Mkono, mtoto kijana hayuko safe kwa pale popote vile mm. wanasema wewe ni mtoto wa kiume mm. na leo imekuwa ni dirisho wazi ya kwamba see how you people are celebrating that date ni vizuri 
tunamtakia ule ni dada mdogo ule ni mtoto wetu akifanikiwa ni furaha yetu lakini tunasema msifunge macho na msifunge masikio muache mtoto wa kiume mtoto wa kiume ndo amebeba mbegu heshima mtoto wa kiume a man carries a seed na seed nyenye anaongeza binadamu wa hii dunia na mwanamke anabeba pia mtoto hachukuliwi for granted but when you destroy ukikula mbegu hakuna siku nyenye utapata kupata nini kupata mavuno it is high time tuamuke tuone mtoto mtoto wa kiume boy child anapitia nini isikuwe ni boy child avumilie mm. aendelee na maisha yake mm. for those who have posted if mm. congratulation mm. mumefanyia dada yetu haki kwa kumpost mm. lakini pia mjue ya kwamba Trevor pia ni mtu anataka support yenu so unajua celebrities we've seen the likes of Lynn Gugi, Jalango, Aziad, many celebrities supporting uh, Eve. Right now as we are talking the channel probably tutalala kama iko 10k subscribers without posting any video. So do you think probably people angefanya the same on Trevor's side? Mimi nasema apart from ku subscribe kwa channel ya Trevor just support na mseme kwamba hii kitu mmemaliza ni sawa lakini msi point finger kwa one party. Mtoto kijana anapointiwa finger sana. Mtoto kijana anapitia maneno mazito. Wana dhania Trevor ana ana mzazi. Wana dhania Trevor pia ana familia ama ana watu wengine. Siku nyenye Trevor anapostiwa watu ndio wako mbele. Oh Trevor, huyu anafaa kufanywa nini? Paka watu ambao ni wanaume wanaona wanasema huyu anafaa kupelekwa kotini. Sio shida. Na tupingi if kukuwa na channel yake. Mimi na subscribe leo kwa sababu Eva ameaini pe interview. Lakini pia sisi wanaume tuache usnitch. Tuache ujinga. Tuonge lugha moja na tupendane. Tukikaa tuonge lugha moja wanawake watatuheshimu. Lakini tukikaa tuna usnitch tutadharauliwa paka kiwango kiasi kwamba itafika pale penye mtoto mwanaume anakunywa sumu tu ndo solution. Isikuwe ya kwamba in everything iwe in the relationship mtoto wa kiume akipitia mazito haiongelewi lakini wa kike ndio tuko kwanza kuongea vile mnapea Eve mungai support peeni Trevor pia support mimi ni mzazi wale ni watoto na kama hamtaki kusubscribe ama mtaki kufollow Trevor don't point fingers at Trevor anaweza kuwa na madhaifu yake anaweza kuwa na mapungufu yake pia Eve anaweza kuwa na madhaifu na mapungufu mm. hamjui supportini kila mtu equal naweza rudia na niseme ni mm. nini uchungu sana na inauma na inakera unapata your point mm. inauma na inakera mm. lakini yote tano tisa mm. to support Trevor mm. and to support Eve Mungai mm -hmm. Okay maybe tukimalizia kwa hiyo ya Eve tumeona Trevor ame react vizuri amemwishia uh, Eve congratulations on her new chapter na tumeona pengine Eve ni kama atabadilisha the way she did her things ni kama anaingia kwa story ya human interest maybe kama vile Lin Gugi yeah. we wish we wish her well mm. a very intelligent woman mm. ni mtu mzuri mm. tunamtakia kila laheri mm -hmm. kwa kila jambo ambalo mm. analifanya mm. na sisi tutam support mm -hmm. yes Anyway, kaspul tukitoka hapo. Juzi tumekuwa na demo wa Facebook. Mimi nikamuuliza, unajua demo wa Facebook wewe kando unajua kuchagua watu. Akasema, nikamuuliza between Kaspul na Salasia, ungependa ni nani apate dada yetu anaitwa Pierre Makena? Akasema, angependa sana Pierre Makena chukuliwe na Kaspul. Demo wa Facebook siku zote nikimuona mimi nafurahia. Yes. Napenda vile anafanya mambo zake. Mm -hmm. Demo Facebook kama haujui historia yake nitakukumbusha mimi ndio nilipata demo Facebook anafanya comedy nikamwambia ingia kwenye hii fani na uone vitu zikifanyika wewe ni shahidi wangu siambi mtu wa mbali wewe Rudy Benny mlikuja na demo Facebook is an honesty na mimi nilimpa support yangu kutoka kwa roho yangu whenever i see demo Facebook na fraia kwa sababu namwambia kila la hii. Mm. She's the most talented girl mm. mwenye tuko nao sasa hii kwenye industry na kama mtoto wetu na kama msichana wetu tunampa support 100%. Lazima a support baba. 
kwa sababu ule ni mama yake Makena na anajua baba yake anaweza kaja na mama yake so yote tano tisa sina chuki kwa vivyote na napenda sana demo wa facebook na namuombea kila laheri kwa vitu zote ambazo anafanya baada plans imefikia wapi wedding wedding iko inakuja na tulia tulia hizi ni za 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 ndani eh kabisa so tutulie tu kawa na habari kama kawa kama dawa kama chawa gavana ndo anaongea eh anaitwa chawa rais 2027 anyway tukiendelea unajua Steve Simpo boy msanii mkubwa by the way Steve anafanyaje katika industry Steve Simpo boy anafanya vizuri sana juzi amepata dada beti chalo Steve Simpo boy atafurahia na breed ni watoto ni breed mzuri kwa sababu mrembo na nini wote watakuwa kitu kimoja naomba kila laheri mm -hmm. na mafanikio kwa ndoa yao mm -hmm. na beti chalo sasa wewe una, unajua kuna fans walikuwa na criticize wanasema surely Steve atezanaje na beti Steve ni kiumbe cha Mungu mm -hmm. hakuna mtu yoyote ambao mm -hmm. hakuya tunasema ati hayuko vizuri ama yuko vizuri mm -hmm. ukicheka mwenzako unamuita sura mbaya mm -hmm. unacheka Mungu mm -hmm. kila mtu amekritiwa kwa image mm -hmm. ya Mwenyezi Mungu wewe nani ucheke mtu sema kwamba kuna vina na kave baya. Steve Simple Boy ameumbwa kwa image ya Mwenyezi Mungu. Ni mtoto wa mtu ni ndugu ya mtu. Tuchunge midomo zetu hata kama tunafanya showbiz. Ana deserve kukua maisha mazuri. Na ndo nakwambia narudi back to wanaume wajinga wa pumbavu wenye wanaongea wanaume wengine vibaya. Why is it that men don't support Steve Steve, Steve, Steve Simple Boy? The day tutakaa chini tuongee kama wanaume mm. wanawake watatusikiliza. Mm -hmm. Baadhi watu walikuwa nasema okay tukitoka hapo tu watu walikuwa nasema oh ndio hiyo kaspola ile criticize kibe na but size kibe you know ndio hiyo ako na hivyo anafanya interview. So wewe ndio unabaki kuwa wakatikati. Mimi si, si, sina mimi sina chochote kuongelea kuhusu kibe because kibe is not of my equal. Na kibe sio mtu mwenye mimi naweza ku look up to. Mm. Kibe sio mtu mwenye siku moja anaweza fungua mdomo watu wamkumbuke watoto wadogo wajue mm. ni mtu mzima mm. watamani kukuwa mzee kama yeye. Mm. Sisi tunakemea lakini tunakemea na wisdom. Na tukemea na ujinga mm. na upumbavu kwa kutumia mm. jina mbaya. Mm. Unapatiwa pointi? Hatukemei kwa kutumia jina mbaya. Mm. Tunakemea mm. kwa kutumia uzuri mm. na kwa sababu wazazi wanatumia mkono ya kushoto kupiga mm. na kulia kuvuruta. Mm. Yote tano tisa lazima mm. tutumie hiyo mkono kwa kulisha. So mm. kibe is not someone that I can talk about. Mm -hmm. Is not my role model. Mm -hmm. He will never be anyone's role model. Mm -hmm. Ni mtu tu mwenye anaweza kusema madafaka na imetosha kupita hapo. Mm -hmm. Lakini vitu za maana na brain mm -hmm. nobody can look up to Kibe. Mm -hmm. You'd rather look up to Sabato Sabato. Mm -hmm. Yes. I'm talking about DJs. Unajua kuna DJ mmoja hapa wa gospel ambaye anaitwa DJ Lebs. Yes. Tumeona one of the biggest gospel artists alimshukuru kwa kucheza mziki yani kule nje ni kama amekuwa among the DJs wenye wana support mziki ya not only Kenya but ki Africa. Unajua kitu moja ambao nilikasirika mm. na nilisikia vibaya sana ni ya kwamba msanii mmoja kutoka Rwanda mm. ambao ni msanii ambao ni mba wimbo sa injili mm. ali strike DJ wetu ali strike ali strike and you remember DJ wetu alikuwa anacheza wimbo wake mm hiyo -hmm. ndo madharau ya ma artist kutoka nje these are an artist kutoka Rwanda o oh, alipata ku strike ali strike DJ, DJ Labs ni madharau tumeweka mm -hmm. environment ya madharau mm -hmm. wewe DJ na kucheza Kenya wewe nani una strike DJ wetu wewe nani and yet wimbo imehitika wewe nani msani kutoka Rwanda hapa village wewe nani unakuja ku strike DJ wetu superstar DJ wetu hizi mm -hmm. ndo madharau ambazo ziko kwenye industry na wasanii wa nje na ma DJ wa nje wanaweka madharau kwa sababu ya upuzi ambao sisi tumeruhusu mm -hmm. tunamuona tunamjua mm -hmm. na tunamfanyia kazi kuanzia next week akifanya show hapa Kenya tuite umbwa. Eh, tukimaliziwa uh, chao rais naona umeanza kuingia mjini yani hadi pale wa Kenya wangependa kusikia. Naona uko nasikiza tune pale nje. Niko nasikiza tune kibao. Uh -huh. Ziko kwa platform uh, unaanza kuzipata kwenye nini kwenye platform yangu ya social media handle uh -huh. ambayo ni Kasipuru Kapon, yeah. Instagram, uh -huh. Kasipuru Kapon, uh -huh. Facebook uh -huh. na kadhalika na chao rais TikTok. Uh -huh. Tunasema ya kwamba at ina lazima itengeneze hela mm -hmm. na ndo maana tumeingia paka bunge mm -hmm. viki mimi kasipuru chawa rais incoming governor nairobi county 2027 mm -hmm. nilitoka nikadiluti jakaranda 
ambao watu wana tusi rais 24/7. Leo hii walikuja kunisalimia wakaniambia kwamba tulikuwa tumebeba siasa kwa roho. Mm. Umetubadilisha umetuingisha kwa content tumejua kwamba leo hii hakuna kitu kama siasa inaendelea. Mm. Wanatengeneza pesa kwa content mimi huyu mwenye unaona hapa nilibadilisha. Mimi nimepeleka comedy paka kwa bunge kuambia watu wetu ya kwamba tuko na even talented MPs wenye wako talented and they are even performing vizuri sana. Salas is performing very well. Honorable Sor is performing very well. But the fact that walirudi chini wakasema kwamba lazima tuoneshe watoto wetu vijana wetu art inalipa na art pia tuko nazo talent tuko talented turudisha watoto kwa harmony bunge ikabadilika kutoka kwa studio ikakuja kwa amani hiyo ndo kazi ya chawa rais na siku zote chawa rais anabaki kwa chawa rais na incoming governor anabaki kwa incoming governor na yote tano tisa aliye juni mkuu atatupigania huyo ni chawa wa rais that has been one on one let us know your thoughts in the comment section about uh, everything that governor 2027 amwangelea until next time guys bye bye